of each other. All right, Little Dragons class starting now. I still have two questions for you. First question is, raise your hand if you are good at following directions. Raise your hand if you are good at listening during class and not just talking all the time during class. Awesome. Very good. Well, here's a test for you. Put your hands on your hips. And jump your feet apart. And jump your feet together. Jump your feet apart. And jump your feet together. Squat, thrust, 
Squat. Stay. Six, sir. Squat. Thrust. Squat. Stay. Seven, sir. Squat. Thrust. Squat. Stay. Eight, sir. Squat. Thrust. Squat. Stay. Nine, sir. Squat. Thrust. Squat. Stay. Ten, sir. Very good. Now in class we run up and down the room normally, but we've been practicing running in place. So, when I say go, well, this will be a little bit different. I haven't found a rhyme for it yet. We're going to pretend we're running all the way down to the end of our row. We're going to pretend we're running around our heavy bag and running back how many times? Ten times. Already? When I say go, start your engines and go. Run, 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 run. Around the bag. Run back. What do you say? What do you say? One, sir. Go. Around the bag again. Around the bag. And back. And two, sir. Go. And around the back. And say three, sir. Again, run up the row. Run around the bag. And run back. Four, sir. Go. Around. And back. Five, sir. Go. Around the bag. Did you go run around the bag? Run around the place. Go. Six, sir. Go. About around the bag. And seven, sir. Go. All the way around the bag. And back. Eight, sir. Go. Around the bag. And nine, sir. And go. Last one. Around the bag. Ten, sir. Very good. Very good. So, what's another way we can run all the way down to the end of the row and around your heavy bag and back? Hopping, okay, hopping. Ready, and go. Hop, 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 Excellent. And another way. Okay. Skipping it is. And go. Skip. And next. Who's next? Call it out. Say it out. Well, some of those sound kind of complicated to do on the video. Hmm. Okay, we'll try it. We'll try it. Skipping backwards. So you're going to start by turning your back to me, and skip, 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 and round your back, skip, now you'll be facing me, because you're going backwards, how does that work, <laughs> alright, maybe we should do one more, what will be the last one, okay, I hear you, rolling like a roly-poly, all right, which in place is kind of just, well, actually is kind of like rolling like a roly-poly, if the roly-poly just keeps rolling back and forth. All right, let's try it. Lay down, get ready, 
and the roll, like a roly poly. Oh man, some of you guys are fast. How can you go so fast in your room like that? Okay, around the bank. Roll back. Well, the good news is, we're already on the floor. So, sit up and face towards me, because it's time to S-T-R-E-T-C-H, stretch. Okay, reach up. Put the legs out in front of you. Make the legs straight. Bend forward, touch your toes. No, 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 wait for me. Count with me. And, oh, wait for me. And... One sir, two sir, three sir, four sir, five sir, six sir, dragon eyebrows, six sir, seven sir, eight sir, nine sir, ten sir. Bend one leg in, reach up again, bend forward, touch your toes. One sir, two sir, three sir, do your dragon eyebrows, five sir, six sir, seven sir, eight sir, nine sir, ten sir. Other side. Reach up, then forward, touch your toes. One, sir. Two, sir. Three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Six, sir. Seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Ten, sir. Bottom of the feet together. Clap your dragon wings. Then forward, touch your nose to your toes. Or as far as you can go. One, sir. Two, sir. Three, sir, four, sir, five, sir, six, sir, seven, sir, eight, sir, nine, sir, ten, sir. Over the leg one apart. Slide the hips forward as far as you can. Go as far as you can. So far that it hurts pretty badly, but not so much that you feel like crying. <sighs> Open the arms up. One, sir, two, sir, three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Six, sir. Seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Ten, sir. Reach to one side. Y el otro lado también. Reach to the other side. Reach to both sides. Oh, yeah. This time we count the colors of the sashes. You can't see them because you're not in the room right now, but can you remember them? I'm going to go slowly so you can get ahead of me and check your work. White sash, gold sash, orange sash, green sash, blue sash, purple sash, red sash, brown sash, brown black sash, black sash. Legs together. You might say, well, what's the brown black sash? In the big dragons. Once you've tested all the way through the different colors, the final one before black is called brown black. It's half a sash of brown with half a sash of black. And it means that you know all the stuff, all the, you're good at all the stuff that a black sash knows. You just haven't taken the black sash test. So brown black also means like black sash candidate. The candidate is someone who could be a black sash and all they have to do to become one is to finish by taking their test. Who thinks they could do that someday? All right. Reach forward, touch your toes, count with me, and one, two, three, three, four, three, five, three, six, three, seven, three, eight, three, nine, three, ten, three, stand up. So sit out. Now we're on the second to last class of this unit. So if you're new to this video, to this live stream, or you're watching this in the future, <clears throat> we slowly covered all this information. So I wouldn't expect a four, five, or six-year-old to suddenly be able to do it one, on one try. But um, we're going to be reviewing it. So this is the first part of the review. Again, if you're brand new, you won't know the answers necessarily. But if you are a regular student and you've learned some of these moves, here's your test. Show me the horse stance. Show me the bow stance. 
Good. Now show me the cat stains. And show me the cross stains. Don't fall. Do the cross stains. Do you remember it? Okay, and the dragon stains. Uh-huh. Okay, okay, good job. And the, wait a minute, do we do another one? Ooh, you'll have to wait for big dragons. It's called jump to kneeling stance. We'll wait for that one. But let's do the moves together, ready? Look up at me, bring your feet together. When I say attention stance, slap your hands here and say, yes, sir. Then I'm going to say stand tall. You're going to bring your fist way up here by your ribs, and you'll say, yes, sir. Very good. Then we're going to start. So let's try it. Attention stands. Stand tall. Open tiger claws. If you're new, watch my feet. And say, tay, tai, pei. Tay, tai, pei. Horse stance center. Bow stance right. Horse stance center. Parents, I'm doing a mirror image. Bow stance left. Horse stance center. Cat stance right. Horse stance center. Cat stance left. Horse stance center. Cross stance right. Horse stance center. Cross stance left. Horse stance center. Are you with me? Crane stance right. Horse stance center. Crane stance left. Horse stance center. Dragon stance right. Horse stance center. Dragon stance left. Horse stance center. Feet together. Oh, very good, very good. Let's do it again. We're going to go about the same speed. And ready? Up to stance. Stand tall. Open tire claws, say, tay, tai, pei. Tay, tai, pei. Horse stance center. Bow stance right. Horse stance center. Bow stance left. Horse stance center. Cat stance right. Horse stance center. Cat stance left. Horse stance center. Cross stance right. Take the foot. Take this foot, put it behind the other one, and you bend the knee. It's on the other side. Are you doing the same hand as I am? All right. Horse stance center. Cross stance left. Horse stance center. Crane stance right. Horse stance center. Crane stance left. Horse stand center. Dragon stance. Remember, if your legs are just all split apart, you can do the dragon by squatting with your feet like this, and then sticking one leg out while balancing with your hands. And on this one, the back heel is up. Horse stand center. We have another one where it stays down. Dragon stance, left. Horse stance center. Feet together. There we go again. So, since we're on the last few classes of this unit, I've been showing, and now we're, and we're live streaming, I've been giving you some bonus moves from the big dragons class. Last time, do you remember what it was? Parents, they usually can't remember after just one or two times. It was the tiger front block. Oh, you knew it, huh? Okay, good. Then we also introduced last time the outside tiger block. Yeah. We don't normally learn this until we're in the big dragons class. And then I do believe we did another one. 
I'd be very surprised if you remembered. We barely covered it. It was called Down, Up, Out. Okay? We're going to review those three right now. Then we're going to learn another new one that's so much fun. And then guess what we're going to do? You're right. The 36 chambers. All right. Let's do a couple of those blocks real quickly to review. Attention stands. Say yes, sir. Attention stands. Stand tall. Open tiger claws. Say tay, tay, pay. Tay, tay, pay. Tiger front block. One, two. No, no, don't, don't count it. I count it. You just breathe out. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Get together. Tiger outside block. Open tiger claws. Say tay, tay, pay. Tay. Tiger outside block. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Feet together. Very good. Okay. Down, up, out. Stay with me. Attention stands. Stand tall. Open tire claws. Say, take, tie, pay. Take, tie, pay. Down. Another one called center side center, but we're going to skip it because the new one that's more fun is called cat stance down block. You remember the cat stance? Get in your cat stance. Get your cat stance here going. Are you doing the same as me? Check your feet. All right. Now the hand that's out far away, have it blocked down by your knee. See how the claw turned and the other claws here? Then you're going to switch the feet. Make a big circle with the other hand. Block down by the knee. Put the hand here. Oh, I know it's challenging. This is hard. Maybe not for all of you. But this is from the Big Dragons class. So it is meant for like kids that are seven years or older and adults. Okay. And we'll do it again. it happens faster. Oh, did you do it? Let's try again. Two more. Excellent. Very good. Guess what? We can do that 36 more times, or we can do the 36 chambers. And it's just me and you today, so you get to have all the fun. Okay, 36 chambers it is. Let me get my pad. What is the first chamber of the 30? That's right, it's ducking. You're the only one that's got a duck. Now, after you duck, if you want another turn, if you want me to swing again, just like class, stay him back up right away. So I'll do it slow at first. Yeah, duck, and come back up. Duck, come back up. Duck, come back up. Duck, come back up. Come back up. Okay, get ready. Yeah, yeah, I know that was easy. That was easy. What is the second chamber? That's right, jumping. Another easy one. But can you do it? Ready? Here it comes. It's just you and me. And jump. And jump. And jump. And jump. Okay, I'm not going to say it. Get ready. Yes, again. Yes, again. Yeah, don't get hit. Yep, yep, again. Again. Okay, easy peasy. What's the third one? That's right, it's dodging. Remember, dodging isn't running away. Dodging is get out of the way and come back. Or get out of the way 
and come back. Because I'm coming straight down on you. Here it comes. Don't move. Get ready. Keep your eyes on me. And get out of the way. Come back. Get out of the way. Come back. Out of the way. And come back. Out of the way. Come back. Out of the way. Come back. Did I get you? Okay, we have time. Let's do uh, the other one. Is called. That's right. Evading. Evading. I'm going to come straight at you, and you have to be like a door that swings on its hinges, and you kind of take a step. Yeah, I know some of you've been spinning. It's not spinning. It's just. Get out of the way, turn so that this misses you, and come back. You can go either way, but you have to take a little step and turn and keep your eye on the pad. Here it comes. I'm going to go slow. No, don't turn yet. Wait for it, and turn. And turn. And again. Again. Uh-huh. Good. Uh -huh. Did you get it? No? That's I hear the next instructor's here almost ready to start his class. So, we'll have to do more next time. Thank you for joining me for Little Dragons. Look forward to seeing you on a future live stream, or if you're watching this years from now, I hope this was helpful for you. And we'll see you in the next live stream or in class. Oh, we got a bang to go on. brand new, just kind of follow along. We follow the five hearts, faith, respect, perseverance, patience, and humility. Bow to me.